hey guys welcome back to my channel once again today i'm gonna do a very simple and interesting eye transition it is not time consuming transition and this eye transition requires little time so let's jump into adobe premiere pro to do this transition here in adobe premiere pro i have two video clips first one is eye second one is hand okay guys now i'm gonna place hand video underneath the eye video well now i'm gonna select eye video so let's do it I'm moving over to the effect controls and scroll down under opacity I will select ellipse to draw a marks on program monitor so let's do it now I have to click this inverted well done now I'm moving to the program monitor and changing the masking point so let's do it well now i am gonna add a couple of keyframes in this point you have to place the time indicator on right position here is mine now i am gonna click stopwatch of marks path to add a keyframe here now i am gonna do the same thing for marks expansion okay this is the keyframe now i have to change the marks feather i am gonna set it 500 okay let's see the change on program monitor so this is well now i am moving last frame of the i video to add last keyframe so now i'm gonna click this point to add this keyframe now i'll change masking points for this keyframe first of all i have to select mask one then i will adjust program monitor let's change masking points as like at this tutorial well i'm skipping this part so you no need to wait let's get back to regular program monitor size now we can move time indicator to see our transition that we have already done so this is the simple eye transition but very interesting so here is the issue that we have to fix in this case i'm gonna add another keyframe of max expansion so first of all i will select this keyframe then i'm moving this time indicator to the left on frame so let's do it and click here to add keyframe well now i'll change this keyframe's value i'm gonna set it negative 1000 so guys problem has solved i wanna make this eye transition cinematic that's why i have to add cinematic black bars so right click here then select adjustment layer now we can hit ok dragging this adjustment layer to the third track of the timeline now you can cut unnecessary part of this adjustment layer take this tool make a cut here get back and select selection tool Select this unnecessary part of the adjustment layer and hit delete key from the keyboard. Now I have to apply crop effect so I am moving here in effects and searching for crop effect. Now apply this effect to this adjustment layer. Ok, make sure that adjustment layer is selected. Now moving over to the effect controls. Under crop effect, at first I will set top, its value will be 15. Okay, so this is the cinematic black bar. Now, bottom, I will set it 15 too. Okay, so this is our transition, it looks like cinematic now, but here is some problem. We have to render this video first so go to the sequence and render into out or hit the enter key from the keyboard to make this transition smooth i hope this tutorial does help you to make simple and interesting eye transition see you later in the next tutorial bye for today